Good morning, GCA family. I'm Colin. And I'm Tristan. And in this week's news, we have five segments. First is our weekly verse with Savannah. Next is forecast with Fergie. And we have two interviews with Owen Harder and Mrs. Rafa. And lastly, our sports update with Carson Carter. And now to Savannah with our weekly verse. Thank you, Tristan. The verse of this week is Proverbs 3, 5 through 6. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways, submit to him and he will make your path straight. Now to Fergie with the weather. Thank you, Savannah. Welcome back to Forecasting with Fergie. The weather for the rest of the week will be in the high 90s and low 75s. Back to you, Colton. Thank you, Fernando. And now we have our interviews with Owen and Miss Rafa. Thanks, Colton. And now we have Owen Harder, and we're going to be asking you a few questions. So, how do you think the cross country team is going to do this year? Uh, I think it's definitely going to be a good season. We lost uh, a good amount of seniors last year, but I think we have a good young core, and it'll be a good year. So, I'm excited to see what we'll do. And next, how has the new campus impacted you for training? Uh, the indoor track is definitely nice on some occasions. It can get a little bit uh, old, obviously, because it's not a very big track. But um, the campus is nice, and the routes around here are really nice. So. Yeah. And lastly, how do you think? Like, do you think you're going to continue running in college? Uh, I'm not sure yet. Uh, I've talked to a couple colleges, and it's definitely on the table, but I'm not for sure yet. So. Okay. Those are all my questions. Thank you for answering, and back to you, Tristan. Thank you, Savannah. Today we have Mrs. Rafa, and we have a few questions for her. So how did the transition from north to south go? I really think it went amazing. I mean, we have this brand new facility. It's awesome. Everybody gets their own room for the most part. Um, and I just, I think that the fact that like we were able to just transition in so smoothly is just awesome. Um, I love that uh, we all get to be connected in different areas. I get to see more people doing this now, and it's, just, it's great. I love it. And do you have any advice for the students that may be nervous from the transition? From the transition, um, I understand that like this is going to be a new school year, and like we're still trying to figure things out. My biggest advice would be please don't trample anybody in the hallway. Um, also, if you're super nervous, come and find a teacher that uh, can just talk to you about it. I know that sounds so dumb, but I think that there's nothing better than going and talking to somebody that you can really trust. Um, if you come to my room, I have Hershey Kisses, so there you go. <laughs> And how are you enjoying having your own classroom? I love it. Oh my goodness. I do desperately miss having a room with Mrs. Balshek. Andrea, I love you. Um, but I loved being able to decorate my room the way that I wanted and then getting to have my big, beautiful tapestry in there and all my little posters. I just, I think it's the best. And I'm so excited to get the new desks so that everybody can just kind of feel settled in and then. Um, then after that, I'll be able to like add a little bit more stuff to it, so I'm excited for that too. This is just the best. Thanks, Grace. Welcome back to your week's sports news. I'm Carter. And I'm Carson, and this is This Week's Sports. On Monday, Varsity Volleyball is away at Providence Crystal Ray at 6. Girls Varsity Soccer takes on Traders Point at 6.30. Tuesday, we have a JV Volleyball game at home at 5.30 with Varsity to follow at 6.30, both playing Monrovia. On Thursday, Girls Varsity Golf plays at Edinburgh at 5.00. Boys Varsity Soccer plays at Morristown at 5.30, and Bar Girls Varsity Soccer plays at home against International at 6. On Friday, we have JV Volleyball at home against Bethesda at 5.30, and a Varsity game also against Bethesda at 7. On Saturday, Boys and Girls Cross Country takes on the Columbus North Cl Classic at 7.15 a.m., with Boys Varsity Soccer playing Southwestern at 10.30. Back to you, Colton. Thank you, Carson and Carter. I'm Colin. And I'm Tristan. And, and thank, thank you, you for, for watching CCNN. CCNN.